Hey guys, it's me, Art of Wonder, and today I have a tutorial on a bottle cap snowman ornament. The materials you're going to be needing is first any type of design of ribbon. I just chose this random one I received in a package, a birthday package. Um, a next item you're going to be needing is, of course, bottle caps. Um, it doesn't matter where you receive your bottle caps from, just I recycled my bottle caps, so yeah. Next, you're going to be need, needing is some white glitter. Um, any brand of glitter that will work. I just got received this from my friend Emily. And she's an awesome person to have given this for me for my birthday. So I thought I'd use it in this tutorial. Another material you're going to be needing that will be important as well is, of course, some any type of brand of permanent markers or paint markers that will be useful. I have this Craft Smart Black um, paint pen that I will be using for the snowman's face and it just makes my life way much easier if it was to be a paint pen instead of just a regular permanent marker. And you are also going to be needing, that's going to be really important as well, is another permanent marker but of course in orange. Um, and we're going to need that color for, of course, the nose, which is a carrot, so that's going to be really simple. And yes, and another material you're going to be also needing is a white um, Sharpie marker paint pen, which that's what I used in this tutorial. Um, I don't think you really need in a paint pen, but I would um, recommend you using it. And that's pretty much all the materials. Um, also, I forgot to mention... Um, you're also going to be needing super glue, which will be important throughout the whole tutorial. So, the first thing you're going to want to do is grab your white marker, primer marker, and you're going to want to scribble it on all over your bottle cap. And you're going to want to do that to all three of the bottle caps, and you're just going to want to do it in a gently paste that will be as easy as possible for you um basically i just did it um all over the bottle cap and i did it once on like one layer type thing and then i did it again to repeat it to make it more neater i guess so you're just going to want to repeat that step for the other two bottle caps And here I am showing you the finishing touch of the three bottle cups. And now to the next step, you're going to want to have glaze. And right now I'm just um, cleaning my space. And you're going to want to have like some construction paper, some regular newspaper, or any type of paper for when you have to do the step with the glitter. So what I'm doing here is I, using a stick that I usually use for my glitter when I glaze my charms, and I will be placing the glitter in all three bottle caps so then I'm able to pour the glitter onto the bottle caps and it will like if you use glue I wouldn't think it would make like it would turn out good I don't know that's just my opinion so I just used glaze because it was easy and it dried fast and it was a much quicker process for me I mean it's whatever you want to do you can maybe use um, hot glue but it's up to you so after you do that step, you're going to want to grab some white glitter um, and you're just going to want to pour it onto the bottle cap um, really slowly. But it, um, And then you're just going to want to shake it up all around and then just pour out all the extra glitter and you're just going to continue that step for all the other bottle caps. So next you're going to want to, after you finish putting all the glitter on your bottle cups, um, you should have um, a pretty good effect on your bottle cups. I think it's so adorable and I was obsessed with these and I might do this more often. But anyways, back to where we are. We're going to want to grab some super glue and we're going to want to put that bit of a drop on the top of the bottle cap and we're just going to want to place them together, hold them tight and let them dry. 
and I'm just going to put them on the side and for Gorilla Glue it only takes a couple minutes to dry so it's a pretty quick process. After your bottle caps have completely dried together as in a snowman, snowman shaped body, you're going to want to grab your paint pen of the color black and I just drew it on a paper to make sure I knew what I was going to draw. Just a little practice so I just drew the eyes and then the quick mouth really quickly so I had a quick idea what I was going to do before I messed up. <laughs> so um, you're just going to want to put two eyes and you're just going to want to press on it. That's why it's easier if you use the paint pen. It'll just make it easier or you could just use acrylic paint and a thin brush. And then you're going to want to create the buttons on the body. After you finish using the black paint pen, you're going to want to grab a regular orange sharpie marker and you're just going to want to create a carrot as the nose and it's basically a triangle but sideways and that's pretty much it for the face. So in the beginning I forgot to mention you're going to be needing any type of tissue paper just to add on a scarf and I thought to use tissue paper because it added more of an effect of like realistic of how a scarf looks like. It might not feel like a scarf, but it does look like one and I thought it'd be cool to add it on. So basically you could use regular glue or super glue. That's um, in the case, that's what I use so it just doesn't fall off. Um, but I do suggest you just using regular glue because um, the super glue did went through the tissue paper and I accidentally got some on my hands, but it didn't bother me at all, but it might bother you. So just I recommend you just using regular glue for this or just tape. And basically, this is, um, basically, I don't really need to explain how you do need to put on the scarf. It's pretty simple and easy, so yeah. Now for the last important, well not too much of important, but it is pretty cool to add on, is the ribbon part. Basically I trimmed out a piece of ribbon, then I glued it together with some super glue, which I also recommend you using regular glue, but um, I do recommend you super gluing it onto the bottle cap so it will stay on forever. And um, yes, and I just used this ribbon because it matches with the scarf and the colors blend in together. And yep, and you're just gonna wanna glue that on. And you're done with your final snowman ornament. So anyways, that's the ending of this lovely tutorial of mine. So I really hope you guys enjoyed this. Please press that like button if you are enjoying the month of December. And if you are, please press that like button. And also favorite this video. If not, um, you could comment down below and all that other stuff. Click all the buttons in the world to put a smile on my face. Anyways, I hope you enjoyed this tutorial. I had fun making it for you guys. And yes, I hope you guys make this and put it on your Christmas tree and yeah tag me on Instagram if you do decide to make this or any of my other creations because I would really love to see it anyways bye guys